Hi, Scorpio, get ready to do your reading. Let's see what is going on for you, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Okay, a leg up. You can be receiving some help, help from someone around you, help from the universe. That's always a really good card to get right off the bat because it means that if you need help, it could be coming in and it could be coming in a lot of different ways. All right, Scorpio, you also have being flexible. Okay, things may not be going in the exact timing or the exact way you were hoping or expecting right now. But that's okay. It just means that things are going to work out. It just means you have to use sometimes just wait a little longer or do things a little differently. The breathe card just fell right out in my lap with the fork in the road. Breathe because there's going to be some sort of um, decision you're going to have to make here with fork in the road. This almost feels like I've used, used this example because this is the feeling I'm getting. Like you could receive some help and maybe the form of some money then you have to make a decision. It almost feels like, I know a lot of you won't be moving, but this, I'm gonna use an example. Like, then you have to decide, well, maybe I don't wanna go there. Maybe now that I have this extra income, this extra cash, or this person helping me, now I can make a different decision and go in a new direction. It's almost, you know, kind of getting like, you're gonna have a second option, something you weren't expecting, but it's good. It's like, you don't feel so stuck in having to go down one single path. So it's, a, it's an interesting feeling I'm getting because it actually, this flexible is telling me it's going to open up more avenues for you. So, because now, because on the sign, he has at least three arrows, so three or four arrows, that, that's a lot of different direction. It's not just one or two. So something's changing for you here where you have more opportunities. You have the sun. So obviously that's a really good energy for the overall reading. The six of cups, the nine of cups. You have the two of cups in the hidden and the judgment card in the outcome. This could be somebody coming back from the past. This could be more than one person. I've seen that a, a few times this week in readings. Um, it could be, you know, resurgence of a relationship or even a job, the Ace of Coin is under the deck. You do have someone here with the Two of Cups in your hidden position. So it can be someone who is helping you or someone who is very loyal, someone who's a soulmate. It can be platonic. And this could be uh, the person possibly giving you help but let's see, let's go back through here. You have strength card, having to be strong, maybe Leo energy, the three of cups, the magician, hanged man, and the knight of cups. I'm almost getting, you're going to go down one road and you weren't, you were happy with it. You were okay with the Scorpio, but then something comes in and almost changes it to where now you have, like I said, another option. I almost feel like something here is like good, but the hangman always makes you feel like, wait a minute, I have something even better. Or, you know, just, what are you manifesting here, Scorpio? This is a wish fulfillment with the Nine of Cups. Let me do that again. Communication's coming in for you, yeah. Three of Wands. So, I get you will have to make a decision coming up here in like the next three weeks, three months. It may not be right around the corner, but it's a good decision. You have soulmate energy here with the outcome of the Nine of Cups. Um, I do see you happy happier. Let me pull a couple cards from this deck and see what's also showing up for you right now. Okay, anything for Scorpio. Okay, so you have crown. You have honor and respect will come to you. The first card that came up was discord among friends or family, which is interesting. So I don't know if you're dealing with that right now, bickering, if this has something to do Maybe this is the thing you didn't have to do. You don't have to deal with that anymore. Maybe you're going to settle an argument with those two coming out together with respect to honor and respect. Just according to my family and friends. What else is going on for Scorpio? <clears throat> you have bouquet. Compliments from an admirer. Which could turn into romance. Maybe a, at a celebration or a party. Also, if you're going to a party or a celebration... Uh, you may meet somebody new there. Some of you, there's reconciliation here. It does look like that too, the Six of Cups and Judgment. Uh, there could be somebody from your past coming back also. So again, maybe you weren't expecting that. Let me do one more for you. Oh, whale, great worry over nothing. I'm gonna take this one the way it's sticking out. So things are gonna get better, yeah. Feeling tied down or frustrated, things are gonna get better. And that's kind of the feeling I got. Like. You may feel like you have to go down one path and that's just the way you're going to go and you're going to muscle through it and do it, but something else is coming in to change that. We'll see. I'm, I'm going to do another tarot card, but we'll see. Truth. 
something about someone may speak their truth that could change everything what does scorpio need to know with the truth card knight of coins the moon There could be an earth sign or a Pisces or someone from your past who is going to be speaking their truth and telling you something that may change your mind, give you new information. Again, I feel like it's something good. I don't feel like it's something that's going to upset you or harm you. Someone is looking back at the past. They haven't moved on here. This could be someone reminiscing. This could be someone who, is, who could be hiding something and needs to reveal it. But again, it seems to work out in your favor. Yeah, the tower. It could be shocking or surprising, but it's still going to be good. The Ace of Wands fell out. There may be someone who has feelings for you that are hidden. Like maybe someone is coming back. Maybe someone is coming back to express their love or tell you, you know, they want to get together, back together. Listen to your intuition. I feel like something's being sent or someone's being sent into your life to help you. Is what I'm getting with that. Definitely for some of you might be a Pisces. What else does Scorpio need to know? Visionary giraffe. Growth, foresight, and vision. You need to heighten your awareness and intuition. Okay. So you need to go within and really listen to your intuition right now. I guess maybe it would be a good idea to maybe meditate. To tap into like universe or God. And ask for signs if you feel like lost or something also this is a good time to plan your future something about this is going to change the whole direction of your life is what i'm getting with this person i get like you like you, again i'm getting i'm gonna repeat myself i'm sorry you were going to go down one path you were okay with it it was you know you kind of feel like you were going to settle but it wasn't that bad this comes in this news and shifts things for you and now you're seeing a different path with a better future and a better outcome and it feels like it definitely has a person attached to it. So meaning, you know, it's, I don't think it's a job. I don't feel like it's, you know, anything negative. It's actually very positive. You also have the cunning fox, which is very probably Scorpio. Cleverness, deduction, and persistence. Quickly discover your hidden talents. That's an interesting thing. See, I do feel like something could change suddenly. And all of a sudden you're pivoting. I'll clarify that one in a minute here. And then we also have Playful Raccoon. Courage, problem solving, and adventure. Reveal any secrets or deceit in your life. Which is another, to me, Scorpio card. With a secret. You may have a secret. Or maybe someone else is revealing a secret. Okay, what is going on? What is this, this the hidden talent? Something for Scorpio. You've been worrying about things. But the truth is going to come out. It may not be that it's a hidden talent. Again, it's the truth is coming out. Someone might say something. Did it say you would have a compliments from an admirer? Someone may compliment you on something, Scorpio. They may say like, wow, you do that really well. Or, wow, you know, something might click. We're like, okay, you do that well. Maybe that's a new path or some way you can make money or something like that. Also, again, someone with the truth card could be telling you something. And that may just be what's hidden may not be a talent, but you're going to find out something that was hidden. What does this reveal any secrets or deceit in your life? I feel like you may have a secret, but let's see. What is this? It says problem solving. Someone may help you with a problem. Maybe some of you need to also tell somebody about a problem you're having. What is this playful raccoon? Listen to your intuition again. Yeah, you really need to kind of get alone. Get outside. Go in your car. Be alone, turn off the radio, listen to your intuition. What is it telling you to do? What do you feel like you need to do next? It's really important right now this week and you have justice. Wow. Maybe someone has done you wrong though. Maybe this deceit is someone else's. Maybe you need to come clean. Um, again, maybe someone, you're gonna know because it's gonna be obvious. Someone's gonna say something. So I have the tower under the deck. An illusion. Chariot and the tower. Look, you have Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio energy. Might have something to do with a water sign. Okay, Scorpio. What else is Scorpio here? You have a lesson. There may be a person in your life to teach you a spiritual lesson, or again, you're going through some sort of lesson. Apology. I kind of thought that. Friendship is under the deck. 
I thought, is someone coming back to apologize to Scorpio? Is someone revealing something to you? Is someone going to tell you something they did behind your back or something as well? Or reveal, maybe they're going to reveal the true feelings here. I feel like this information this is coming to you. I don't feel like you are necessarily revealing anything at this point. I feel like someone is. So be open, be ready. What else does Scorpio need to know at this time? The moon is coming out in this deck also. Something very mysterious. Again, listening to your intuition. Pisces energy. Something is being revealed. Something's going to be revealed this week, Scorpio. This week or next, but... Someone may say something, apologize. This could be something you're waiting for. It may move you forward. Bear. Bear can be an overbearing person, someone who was very controlling. Hmm. Someone may be bearing a burden, and again, it needs to get it off their chest. This card is number 15, and that would be tomorrow, today's the 14th. So, in anything else, child, something as a child. Childlike, a new beginning, the child, overbearing, childlike energy. Maybe someone has grown up. Maybe somebody is, again, maybe someone went through a lesson and they're apologizing for what they did. So it could come in different ways, definitely, Scorpio. Scorpio's advice. Someone's revealing something. Maybe the lesson is to accept an apology and it will change things. Boundaries could be important right now. Redirect your thoughts for anything negative. And have faith. Yeah. I don't want you... Like, this is a good reading. I don't feel like this is bad, negative. You're not going to have to deal any, deal with anything. Um, this is like a new path opening up. Again, it could be just from a past love coming back and telling you something. Apologizing. Speaking their truth. Seven of Cups. Chariot. Ace of Coin. I feel like you're going to have more direction. I feel like it goes back to the beginning of the reading. Something revealed. Something this week that is being brought to your attention with the Seven of Cups. It can be anything. Also, if you've been feeling overwhelmed or confused, this will again give you clarity. I feel like somebody's hiding something too. Somebody in your family, people are hiding something from you. People are kind of like they respect you, Scorpio. They're in awe of you. They feel like you're very strong. Some of you have like distanced yourself from family or friends or whoever. People are feeling guilty is also what I'm getting. Somebody needs to tell you something that they have done. Again, that's going to close a cycle. And not that you have to like be friends again with these people or anything, but just there's something about a cycle ending by somebody telling the truth. And there's a movement forward. There's something that you are owed also maybe that is coming back to you with justice. There's something very powerful happening here with a truth. So it could come in different ways. That's why the Seven of Cups is here also. It shows that it's happening differently for different Scorpios. Again, be careful this week because that Aries full moon, it could be volatile. It could influence some of you very strongly. So just be prepared. But it's a good week. This is a good message. So I'm going to leave it there, Scorpio. Have a great week.